Welcome back to my Let's Play for Coley Sorrow. I so want to finish this up. Please tell me this is the last boss. Seriously. Yeah, I really don't have time for this Borak. Huh? I've got a lot of crap on my plate right now, so just piss off for a bit, okay? What? Maybe the sandstorm's gone. Maybe. Wow. <laughs> I'm guessing that's the final boss, too. And we just told him to go buzz off. And why is there a small palm tree there? A chance, huh? Wait, did we just leave town just so we didn't hear that and then go back and pick him up? Why? Why don't we just take him then? Jeez. Well, no. Thanks for dragging me into another fight, I suppose. Okay. Let me guess. This isn't all that effective. Guess I'll find out. Good thing we have the assassin here. Of course there wasn't. Wow, we stole 10 MP. Damn. Well, I guess we can try explosions. Those are always nice, right? Gosh darn it. Her magic's too weak. Uh, try sleep again, I guess. But what good's a spell that does like a whole whopping 100 damage despite being, you know, a massive bomb going off? I mean, come on. So disappointing. Guess we can try Saint Attack. I don't know. Probably should buy more remedies while we're back in town, too. Ugh. Just beat the crap out of this guy, I guess. Okay, this is getting annoying. Life drain, maybe? I guess. If we're gonna cost 10, we're only gonna get 10 health back. Never mind, he's dead, so we can just go heal anyway. I'm not giving up the assassin. Seriously. Like, I can already do poison and allergic damage with other characters, so he doesn't even bring anything new to the table. <sighs> and the assassin's far more useful since, you know, triple attack. Well. I'll just carry on the maximum of those. I mean, seriously. There's no reason not to. Well, no. Yep, we tied up all our money real fast there. I so wish we could buy magic waters. But we can't. That's bloody annoying. <sighs> and I haven't found a regular Emmy in the game yet that drops him. Now, don't bring him up again. Seriously. Dragon mail, eh? 
Well, I don't know if anyone in this party can even equip it. I mean, maybe that one guy could. But he ain't here. So the legendary dragon mail is completely useless. Ooh, a sage's ring, huh? I lose 15, cost, cut your spell cost in half, why not? Dorm 8, huh? <sighs> I wouldn't. Good point, never mind. Great. I guess there's a boss battle here. Still can't read the books. A chess key, eh? Creepy music, so you know there has to be something here. Oh, there is, huh? Well, probably in this chest. Eh. Well, I'm not sure if it's up here. Now it's gotta be in the basement. Oh, a bunch of ghosts appeared. Interesting. Let's see. Uh, I go with um lightning, I guess. Well, darn, these ghosts aren't that tough, are they? I forgot we fought these guys earlier, didn't we? Whatever. Kill them for the potion, I suppose. Okay, what on earth is in the basement? That's different. Hmm. Just standing here, my blood began to rush and my skin began to crawl. Play is bloodstained, a creepy special feel comes from it. Oh, someone killed someone. I guess the house isn't as pretty as I thought. Makes me wonder how many other spells I missed. You know? Or is that actually an item? It stops bleeding, huh? Full Phoenix, huh? Well, no. Let's just get away. Let's see anything down here besides your um, typical ghost. And those aren't even scary anymore. Huh. No, no, I don't. <sighs> the sudden tunnel shift when you get encounters in here is pretty dramatic. Oh, nice. I guess we need that to trigger the fight down in the basement then. With the plate being blood stained, it makes sense. Probably gotta nick ourselves. Okay. Let's do this. Well, now what we unleash upon ourselves? Well, can I sleep it? Fire is probably our best bet. So we gotta fight a flesh poppet now, huh? Like a popper? Oh, whatever. Just a tad creepy. Got that right. Oh, if I can, I'm gonna try and keep it locked down. But who knows? Come 
on, just kill over already. I know you want to just give him the death. You're just a bunch of bones and flesh, man. Woke it up too soon, darn it. Well, Mondrain, I guess. I'm not expecting much, though. But we'll find out, I suppose. Oh, better. Oh, whatever, poison. That wasn't all that hard hitting, to be honest. Though it's a, sort of a zombie, so I don't know if Life Train's gonna be a good choice here. Eh, I guess we'll find out. What is it you've done? Probably murdered everyone in the house. At least that's what I'm guessing. And I refuse to forgive it. It's just easier to murder it, you know? Ooh, 4 and 20, huh? Wait. Saint attack. This ought to be good. But I imagine it's still gonna survive through it. <sighs> There's one of the account these bosses, it's that their freaking HP damages HP counts are really high. So they take a massive amount of effort to kill. And usually for the wrong reasons. Just die already. Hopefully that doesn't wake it up. It did. Gosh, it got that right. It really isn't. I mean, we already run to the ghosts, and we've seen the corpses. And I was already guessing it killed everybody here, so... Big surprise there. Here comes Life Train to wake it back up again. Okay. I guess it was guarding that turn. Well, the assassin will woke him up anyway since it's going last. Weird. I just can't see the good uh, turn where the show goes last in this battle, really. So I keep waking this thing back up, and that wasn't my intent. Oh, yeah, I'll try monitoring again soon. Just to keep my mana up on the one character where it actually matters. Well, I guess it matters on the Shaman, too. I'll see what I can do. But I think I'll have to kill you first. Oh, you just tried to insta-kill me? Gosh, damn it. It's like the Reaper. If it gets it off, it could potentially kill you. Damn you, Shaman Lady. You need to be slower. Great. It's going to reduce its damage this turn by quite a bit. There's not much I can do about it besides just push my way through. All that and try and trance MP supply. Hmm. 
not darting this turn, all right. Oh shoot! I actually had a chance to do a light attack on it. Well, hopefully, get another chance, man. It's nice to be able to pull that off, you know. <sighs> After all, it's a thousand damage, and that's pretty sweet. Assuming it connects after all. Though it can't really compete with the uh, our two main attackers. Gosh darn it. And my alarm's going off, so I need to start getting ready for bed. Not bad. Going to work soon. Well, try and finish this quicker then. Oh wait, he casts death, so I gotta try and keep him asleep. Okay. Back out with life drain. Uh, and I know the alarm going off in the background is probably pretty annoying. If it's being picked up at all. Wasn't it asleep? Or can't do that despite being asleep. Because that's kind of freaking impressive. Or is that a last minute defense there to buy time? <sighs> well, whatever. Gotcha. Well, great, now the real wreck of this house is revealed. Gotcha. Whatever. We lifted the curse, now it's been revealed for what really is a wreck. Well, I suppose that'll do for this episode. Until next time, then. See ya.